There appears to be a common pattern in the animes that you guys are treat, uh, suggesting me. For example, Data Live, you know, Shido and Itsuka, Kotori, but at the same time, Mana, blood related sisters, non blood related sisters, you know, a lot of brother sister lovey dovey relationship. What else have you seen so far? Oh, yeah, no game, no life. Shiro and Sora, nothing sus going on there, and now irregular magic high school with Tatsuya and Miyuki. Oh, Onisama! <laughs> Now, does this mean that anime, in a nutshell, is pretty much as incest heavy, which I think it is? Or is it you guys, you degenerates, that's giving me incest anime? Regardless, it's been a pretty fun first episode. Let's begin the second. Oh yeah, we left off at the pretty big point, and he like, didn't blame anyone, right? He didn't throw them under the bus. Mari. Student kind of surprised with them winks, man! I think we got a bigger problem on campus, and it's the fact that people don't even see, you know, these guys as humans. They're just weeds while they themselves are blooms, which is super cringe because, like, oh, I'm a blooming flower. Like, shut the fuck up, bitch. Shiba Tatsuya. Hmm, I'll be keeping an eye on you. <laughs> Damn, wow! Discipline committee, though, huh? Okay. Bro, shut the fuck up, bro. We're not even thinking about you. Get the fuck out of my face. No one asked. I hate you. I don't care if there is a fucking redemption arc in the future. Why would you care about shit? Like, it, it, it's because, like, what do you think is gonna happen if you shit on her fucking brother that you love so much? Like, what do you think is gonna happen? Oh, I'm gonna shit on your brother so that your sister's gonna hang out with me? What a fucking idiot. Oh, what does that look? What? What is it? Oh? No one asked? <laughs> they seem like nice girls. I like the one on the left. She may Maybe she's a Kuza day. She was about to pop off for a second, right? Using some big attack attack? Did she just say Onisama too? <laughs> yeah, did she just say Onisama? <laughs> Miyuki was like, bitch, that's fucking my line. Miyuki looks a little bothered, I'm not sure. Miyuki, look at Miyuki, dude! Will you go out with me? She is making moves, bro. She is fucking making moves. <laughs> How the operating system works? Yeah, you can type on the keyboard. Yeah, it looks like a police baton, like a hitting stick, right? Scions? We're going into the mechanics of how shit works in this show. Like the magic. Secret skills are the arcane arts? Huh? Oh, Prez! Is she gonna wink at us again? Wonder how Miyuki feels every time, you know, her brother gets approached by a bunch of girls when she's with her. On a date with me! Leave my big bro alone! Oh, he's some of you wouldn't! Oh, shit. The disciplinary committee is here, too. What are, what are we doing? Are we getting recruited? So dignified, so elegant. Looking at your hand, did she cut it? <laughs> oh. Oh, is she housewife material? What's going on? Yeah, Miyuki's definitely gonna wake up at 5 in the morning to make, you know, bento for Onisama. They are lovers! <laughs> They're not siblings, bro! <laughs> do we? Well, I do admit, yeah! She's not, she's down. She's absolutely down. She's absolutely down. <laughs> Related by blood! <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck. Holy fuck. He's just straight up cucking all the girls in this room right now. Liar. Cap. Cap. I wonder how the press feels. Oh, Miyuki. She wants it so bad. So the president is now recruiting the member. He's so cute. Immediately shifts the topic to Big Bro. But Tatsuya doesn't want to be in that kind of position. He is a secret. I appreciate that Miyuki is so dedicated to Onisama, but now might be a not good thing to do. But I refer my brother instead. Damn. Damn, two for one. Yes, the student council only got to be waifus. Ah, uh, we're not even course one. As a secretary. Yeah, I mean, it's a good position on the resume, I guess. Then you move for Prez later on. Go for it. Remaining spot in the disciplinary. That's where maybe Tatsuya goes? Oh, here we go. There's no restriction for a course, too. 
I don't think Tatsuya wants these rules, though. Mari definitely wants to poach Tatsuya, but... He doesn't want to do that shit, though, right? This is like extra volunteer work. He doesn't give a fuck. Yeah, wait, hold up. He just goes around the hall and say, Hey, you, your shorts are too short. Hey, you, you lift up your skirt a little bit lower or some shit. Yeah, they're like the hall monitors, you know? You go to the fucking bathroom during lunchtime or like during class time and there's the hall monitors that's like, Do you have a bathroom card? Tatsu would be so good at this job. I mean, Tatsu was kind of doing that last episode, right? Bullshit! You fucking failed that test on purpose, didn't you, or something? He's so intent on going under the radar. What is his ultimate goal? What a secret is he hiding in Miyuki, Jesus Christ? The fuck is this? Not gonna lie, Glasses is extremely stacked. Very, very stacked. Is Erika no Mari? You put your palm down, some kind of magic, and then what? You see how far it goes? Um, maybe some kind of aptitude test for magic, yeah? Can Tatsuya do this? He has no practical magic abilities or something, right? But, you know, he's a main character, so... Slow. Okay. Um, What's too slow? His way of pushing the thing? He truly is limited in some aspect. I'm not completely sure what it really is, but it's the practical magic shit, right? <laughs> Look at her looking out the window as if she didn't even know they were coming. Oh wait, who is this? It's, it wasn't Mari. This motherfucker! Ah, oh, no! 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 Leave! 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 I hate you! I hate you! Get the fuck out of my face! Wait. Am I, is it the same guy? Am I, remember the guy that we hated? Is it the same guy? I forgot his name. I, I can't tell if it's the same guy, actually. The Disciplinary Committee HQ? What is this, some kind of sex dungeon that Mari wants to take Tatsuya to? Vice Prez, you're losing all your authority by blushing like this and arguing. No weed. Weed blooms must stay pure. Oh, it's a forbidden word? Damn, this is like the equivalent of like muggles in Harry Potter, you know? It's like a very discriminatory taboo word. Okay. Then test him. Why don't you test, you know, let's do a duel. Let's see who's more practical, you know, who's more competent. Activation sequences. He can read magic and predict it. Oh. His brain processing power is so fast that he can understand what the magic is going to form into. That's what he was doing last episode? He's hot. He's super hot. <laughs> so by having a course 2 student represent, you know, it'll maybe lessen the gap, but wouldn't that make it more volatile? I feel like people would get more upset, you know, if a weed made it in here. Okay, Mari is uh, pretty dignified, you know, I respect her a lot. Bro, you're making a fool of yourself right now. Why don't you fucking duel then? Let's see who's better. Let's fight them, motherfucker! His skills are incompatible with the method of assessment. Again, these schools only test in a specific way that doesn't truly represent how strong they are. Just like chivalry of unveiled night. You're not the one being calm and rational here, bro! You're, fucking, you're throwing a fucking tantrum! I don't like him at all. Nepotism? Okay, she's kind of right about that. Nepotism is kind of true here. <laughs> Onisama! <laughs> Come on, let's fight. A duel. Let's see who's stronger. Tatsuya, get in there. Slap his ass. Come on. Oh, oh the tie's coming up. Okay, I thought he was going to take a spot. Duel. 
du? Oreto <lacht> Mogi. Nani? <laughs> Everybody. Nani? Did you say present face? I love that shit in anime. When something happens and it pans to everyone else, you know, their reaction, they're like, Nani ga okashi. Because you're going to get bodied, bro. That clock looks like a dick, bro. Look at that. It's a shaft. Yeah, we don't... It's, yeah, we don't care about that, but you, you can't just fucking... You're gonna disrespect me in front of my little sister? Oh, oh it's gonna be good. <laughs> this is gonna be good. Oh, shit. No, thank you. Thank you for this. I love moments like this in this show. Uh-uh. 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 This is amazing. You've done well, little sister. Oh, more head pads. I do the same. Onisama! That hand placement on the cheek, man. A, a fitting phrase, Onisama. I love you, Onisama. Alright. Damn, they just used guns, huh? I mean, they were using guns last episode, too. My man is about to get humiliated in front of his fucking leader, the disciplinary committee, you know, pres, the fucking student council pres, everyone important here. So this is a CAD. The guns? What does he have? Fight to the death. No, fight to the death. No, I want heads to fucking fall off. Weapons are prohibited <laughs> as we hold a fucking gun. Whoever strikes first with a spell. But he can read your spells. So cringe how he keeps referring himself as a bloom. He's like, I'm a blooming flower. But his physical capabilities are insane too. So Tatsuya will probably like prevent him from you being able to use any magic by reading him. And then like maybe he'll like use a ninja training. Like what? Essential singularity type movement spell. Nani? Okay, that's what you think will happen. But Tatsuya is probably reading like three steps ahead. Shobu! Fuck him up! Let's go! <laughs> Look at my magic powers! Oh shit! What do you do? What do you do? No, I just nothing personal. He just showed up behind, and suddenly he's done. That was too quick. No, I wanted to fucking save her. The revenge. Somehow we won though. He just knock him in the back of the head with his gun. Like that was it. He just beat him with brute force speed. Like what? Okay, sure. Oh, they're not gonna explain it this episode what happened, right? I love moments like this, man. Whenever the main character in these type of shows keeps getting looked down, it's like you want a duel, and then everyone's witnessing, right? The important people are witnessing. It'd be better if this was like a tournament and we had a packed full of arena and they could see the fucking humiliation. Oh, I don't know what Tatsuya did at the end there. Because he just suddenly appeared behind. And then that dude seemed like he was like visibly just like disturbed somehow, right? So is that Tatsuya's bonking him with the gun? Did he do something else? I don't really know. They're slowly telling us, you know, how Tatsuya is, you know, incapable of using practical magic and like that fucking, what, what was that? We were like putting our hand on that thing and then the fucking robot car would move and it's like, he's like, that's too slow. But at the same time, he's really good at like understanding the operating system of the CAD and typing on the keyboard with all 10 fingers and being able to read spells. And apparently that takes a lot of processing power that no human can do. So this guy's probably like reading cards. You know how like in um like in gambling or like uh in, what what's that? There's like a card game or something, and if you're able to memorize all possible combinations, is it blackjack? No, it's may maybe it's blackjack. I forget. But it's like some kind of crazy Rayman like um almost like godlike ability to be able to count cards in your head. Does he have that kind of power where he can just kind of do so well so that he can prevent people's spells from even being used? I don't know. But shit's getting pretty hype. But hey, if you're still here, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.